In this exercise, we're going to be getting into unloading and detaching an external referenced drawing. So right now I'm in the 08 points 2 drawing, which is located in your tutorials folder. And if you remember, we had an XREF here that's currently on the XREF layer. And this XREF layer, if we turn on our layer control by typing in LA, this XREF is currently locked. So if I close this down, and if I decide to pull up my XREF manager by typing in XR, I can select my XREF, right click, and select unload, even though this XREF is currently on a locked layer. Now why would somebody need to unload an XREF? Is it still attached to the drawing? Currently, this XREF still is attached to the drawing. There are times when you might not need to see this XREF drawing when you're working in your current drawing. However, you would still like to have it attached to your drawing just in case you need to bring it back up again. And we can bring it back up by right-clicking on that XREF and clicking Reload, and it brings it right back. However, if we want to just totally detach this XREF from our drawing, we can right-click and select Detach, even though this XREF was on a locked layer. So these are just some of the options when you're dealing with XREFs. Sometimes when you're hatching large areas on a site, sometimes that hatch can take up a lot of space when you're looking to process some of these drawings. Sometimes you, you might get some drawbacks to load times when you're actually opening up a drawing. So when you're dealing with large amounts of hatch, if that hatch is on an XREF drawing, then you can just unload the drawing so that way you can move around within your drawing a little bit easier. So those are just a few options that you have when you're dealing with externally referenced drawings.